Welcome to the Live Lighter Arab Festival 2019. We've got various Arab communities here today celebrating this wonderful event. And it's going to be a beautiful one that is going to live in the memory of everyone that participated today. Let us sit back and enjoy this event. And this is a perfect opportunity for it's not only the Arabs and the Islamic, but the whole world. And it's showed here in Australia, the unity. This unity is it's so great that we hope it continues, not only with the Arabic community or Islamic community, but with, with all the minorities and the majorities here. We'd like to convey our deepest sympathies to the families of, and the government of New Zealand. The reality is that we are all here together as Australians and some Australians have been a bit behind in beginning to appreciate the contribution that people of a Muslim background, Islamic faith can make to Australian society. The true nature of people of an Arabic, of an Islamic background, of Islamic faith, they're seeing the love, the compassion, the caring, respectful nature of people who are Muslim and realising that they're humans just like any of us, very important contributors to West Australian society. It's about social cohesion, it's about people in Perth uniting together. It doesn't matter what background you come from, what country you were born, what religion you have, or what type of food you eat. All people in this community have the right to feel safe. But I've been working with the Australian Arab Association for the past four or five years. It's been fantastic for me as a police officer in the WA Police Force to work with some of the community to understand how the community operates, but also for them to understand how we work as WA Police. We're from all over the world. We are truly multicultural in our team. We truly want to stand proud and strong with the uh, Arab community. We are all here to have harmony, I guess, to show you, keep each other, one another um, connected. So we're very multicultural here in this event. And the message that I want to send out to, to, you, to you guys out there is love one another, respect one another, create peace, have hope, have faith. Don't discriminate anyone. Let everyone practice what they want to practice and let everyone pray how they want to pray because we all believe in the same God. My name is Vanya from La Tatiflet. Today we're celebrating the Arab community in Perth. Yeah, I feel so glad. So I got the opportunity to put my stall up here in Arab Festival. People are very nice, very lovely, very accommodating. Nurture the Arabic language. It's so important that Australia is a multicultural society doesn't become a monolingual society. We really need those language skills. They're important to us for all kinds of reasons. For business, for cultural exchange, for diplomacy, we've got to be strong, confident, and really aware when it comes to being on the international stage. So the Arabic community has a very important role to play in Australian society. I do a lot of work with the Indian associations, with the Sikh community, with the Arab community, with the Islamic community, it is absolutely fantastic to see Australian society building together. And this culminates in Harmony Week as well. The only message I'd like to convey is uh, this unity is it's so great that we hope it continues. And not only with the Arabic community or Islamic community, but with, with all the minorities and the majorities here, it's been a pleasure to participate in this event and we hope to be active in other events. Thank you very much. Tony ETC reporting for Undercurrents.